to my little friend! That's it, I swear. How you doing? So as you can tell from the title of this video, this is a very, very expensive suit. I'm gonna wear it all day today to see how it does as work apparel. Let's go! So why am I in an extremely expensive suit in a dirty hot rod mechanic shop? Well, one of my subscribers has a suit company. He basically reached out to me. He said, hey, did you see Whistle and Diesel's video where he wore some extremely expensive Air Jordans on a construction site? I said, yeah, I thought it was funny. He thought it was funny too. He said, I got some suits. We kind of just started talking from there. <laughs> he basically went through the sizes he had. He said, I'm built like a gorilla or a linebacker. I don't know if he was throwing shade or if that was a compliment, but either way, he said, I have a couple that you can have. I told him, I said, I have no need for a nice suit, so I'm just gonna ruin it. He said, that's fine, it'll be funny. So, Armani suit, baby, pants and everything. I mean, we are decked out. Way too nice, way too nice. It's already super hot. It's only like 80 degrees in the shop. I'm just beating down with sweat because there's just too many layers. But we're gonna work all day in this bad boy and see how it works. I gotta do some sheet metal work on the Mustang. We're gonna change out the fuel pump on the 54 Chevy. I'm also gonna probably sand around on it because we're gonna be clear coating it pretty soon. And we might also be doing another lace job on the roof, just like we did on my 51, which I think would be kind of cool. So let's get to work. <laughs> so the first thing I'm gonna work on today is upgrading the fuel pump on this 54. I'm gonna go with an electric fuel pump. Mechanic pumps are usually fine. This one's going out. I was just going to put a new mechanic pump in it, but I decided to go ahead and just go with electric. I think they're easier. Some people like them a lot less. Some people like them more. I don't know. I just like the electronic because I know whenever I hit that key, it's good. You can also hear it, which is nice. But if for some reason I end up not liking it, it's real easy to put the mechanical pump back on. The only thing that sucks with an electric pump is it needs to be mounted near the tank because they push gas a lot easier than they pull gas. It would be nice to just put it over here where my mechanical pump is because all the lines already ran can't really do that so we need to bypass the mechanical pump and we're gonna have to redo some tubing in the rear to mount the electric pump it's not gonna be that big of a deal but let's get this bad boy up in the air so we can get some stuff done also i've been in the shop for like 10 minutes i'm just sweating so we're gonna be losing layers here really quick i'm definitely putting the ac on and uh yeah i'm gonna i'm gonna go as long as i can with the jacket on but i have a feeling the jacket's gonna be coming off very soon. <laughs> so my neighbor just saw me. She said I looked great, but it looked like I was going to court. I thought that was hilarious. Also, I feel like an Italian mob boss. I only got like 10% Italian in me, but it's coming out whenever this nice suit is on. So naturally I'm gonna have to do some movie quotes. <clears throat> I gotta get in character. I made him an offer he can't refuse. Say hello to my little friend! Alright, that's it, I swear. There's fucking helicopters everywhere, they're following me! <laughs> oh my god, man. Woo! I'm like 15 minutes into work and I can't breathe. I didn't have a damn heat stroke. I think the jacket's gotta go. I think the jacket's gotta go. Oh, that's a lot. Ooh. Oh, holy shit, this might end up being a short day. Damn, it's hot. Let's get back to work. Holy shit. So naturally I'm an idiot and jacked it up before I needed to, but that's fine. No big deal. We'll stand on our tippy toes. I'm bypassing the mechanical pump up here. Just going to bypass it with a line and then we'll move to the back. I don't know how much you're going to be able to see. I'll get the camera up under there if I can. Um, I don't know how much I'm going to be able to get under there, but what's cool is see, some of these electric pumps don't come with these tabs on them i mean most do but some don't but what's cool on this is where the line runs it runs right next to the rail so i should be able to just screw this right into the frame rail and then it'll just go right in so also uh, about 45 minutes in we are untucked 
and we got this rolled up. Still hot, but not as bad as it was. Check it out. I got the mechanic fuel pump bypassed. So now we're gonna go get the electric put on. Also update, I'm an hour and a half in. I'm sweating like crazy and I just ripped the hell out of my tie. So probably gonna have to lose the tie. So, so hot. It is ridiculously hot. I don't even know how people wear these damn things. <laughs> okay, let's get under the car. Check it out. Got it right here in the wheel well. I gotta change my wiring still, but the tube looks perfect, or the line looks perfect. Now I just gotta run the wiring, we'll throw a battery in it and make sure it's working. Okay, I think I got it. Should just come on with my ignition right now. <laughs> uh oh, that's not good. That's not good at all. Oh no! I think I got too much fuel pressure. Either that or my float wasn't uh, on. There we go, okay. I might still need to run a pressure regulator. That fuel pump's only supposed to be like two PSI, that's supposed to be a little bitty. I think my float might have just been stuck. Okay, cool. Definitely need to keep an eye on that because I don't want to just be dumping gas <laughs> down my intake. All right, let's try it again. Great news, it's running good. I went ahead and checked. I had a little leak in the back, got it fixed, no big deal. I think while I have it jacked up, I'm gonna pop these hubcaps off and paint the rims real quick. I bought some high heat engine paint a couple weeks ago. I'm just gonna go ahead, give them a real quick scuff and shoot. I think we're gonna be clearing this one. We're gonna be trying out the Harbor Freight paint guns. They sent me one of every gun they have. So I got a bunch of new paint guns we're gonna be trying out. We're gonna be clearing this. And like I said, we might be doing a flake or a lace on the roof, I don't know. Either way, I wanna get it really good and cleaned. So while I'm gonna power wash it, I'm gonna go ahead and power wash these two. This one is going to the owner, uh, trying to shoot for a pickup. I think on Thursday of this week. I've had it set up for shipping three or four different times and the shippers kind of flaked out on me. They don't like how low it is. <laughs> so that's one of the problems, but uh, we'll get it worked out. This one, I actually just bought this back. It's been kind of a thing. The winner that got it on my giveaway, he really needed money. It's kind of had a hard time. I told him to take the car and sell it. He would probably make more money that way, but he's just a big fan. And he was like, hey, if you can just cut me a check, work something out. So I ended up actually buying this back. Bought it back for probably more than I should have, <laughs> but I am happy it's mine now. So that was really cool. We're definitely gonna be doing more giveaways soon. I think I'm probably gonna be doing the 51 Chevy at some point. Also, a bunch of people were asking about my dad's uh, 55 Chevy truck. We'll probably end up doing that at some point too, but uh yeah, I ended up buying this one back, and uh, I don't know. I think I'm going to cruise it this summer, maybe have some fun with it. Then I don't know. I have no idea, but I'm excited to play with it because I haven't really drove it much. But this one we're giving away, in case you didn't know, for free at 100K whenever I get to 100K subs. Don't know when that's going to be, but whenever it happens, we'll do a completely free giveaway. These giveaways, you have to buy a piece of merch to get entered. This one will just be free. If you are a YouTube subscriber, you will be entered to win, but we got to get to 100K first. So yeah, I said all that because I need to paint and I don't want to because I'm lazy, but uh, yeah, let's scuff these and paint them. <laughs> Paint job looks good. I'm gonna go ahead, wash both of these real quick. I just caught my leg on a piece of metal over there. Ripped it real good. That's nice. Also ripped a button out earlier. Uh, but I mean, overall they're holding up pretty good. I think I'm like four hours in. 
Not too bad. Yeah, let's wash some shit. <laughs> My dad just got off work. I told him to come by, so I'm gonna throw this shit on real quick, even though I'm hot. <laughs> that now? You're on camera, by the way. Oh, yeah. uh, I don't know if you're on camera. Hold on, let me see. No, you're not on camera. <laughs> Armani suit? Does it say Armani on it? No. Oh, there you go. It's... You're looking pretty good there. Started you need out. You get a top hat. <laughs> I was doing a bunch of mafia quotes earlier. I was going to make him offer a game of fuse. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so the day is almost over. I got everything washed. I was going to hop in the 54 and take it for a cruise, but I got a little bit of time left before I need to do that. So I'm going to work on the 65 Mustang. I need to get the rear bumper mounted and do a bunch of welding. It'll be a perfect way to end my whole, you know, Armani suit video is do some welding, some grinding. So far it's doing pretty good. I definitely got some rips in it, but I mean, I think anything probably would have been ripped the way I did it. Overall, other than it being extremely hot and extremely thick material, it's been holding up pretty good. Not too bad at all. But let's continue on the 65. And then I think I finally have this running good enough where I can, uh, you know, throw it in gear and actually take it for a little bit of a longer drive. Granted, I still don't have a glass. I'm waiting on that. And that's a whole nother story in another video, but I would like to be able to get it and maybe drive it, you know, a couple miles down the road, but we'll do that at the end of the video for now. Let's cut some shit. All right, we're coming up on the end of the day. Look how filthy this thing is. <laughs> I'll do a recap on it whenever we get done. But for now, let's take that old girl for a spin. I had to put the I had to put the suit jacket back on because I feel like a gentleman during this drive. Cam is rolling, suit is on. Let's see what happens. should, should is a word I say a lot, should be able to actually just drive. Whoa. That's gonna fall off, I can already tell. Yep, it already did. Ah, shit in the eyes. Shit in the eyes already. Oh, cop drove by, that's fun. and probably saved. The tie cannot. The tie's got cut. The tie was actually dangerous as hell in a shot because this could have got caught on something. I don't know how the old timer used to do it. I caught this on a grinder that was off and it just barely had a little bit of, you know, spin left to it. And it kind of wrapped it up, but I had it real loose. Luckily, you know, it didn't like wrap around my neck. The shirt has a hole over here. And I think I ripped two buttons. Pants got a hole right there. And I think they got another one back here also spilled gas on them so they reek. It was a lot of fun. <laughs> I am extremely happy that the 54 is running very well. It obviously still has a lot of things that need done to it, but I'm happy that it's running awesome. I just need to get the door <laughs> working a little bit better because the door is just flying open while I was driving it. That was not fun. Stay tuned. We're going to be doing some more work on that. We're going to be clear coating it with the new Harbor Freight paint guns. We're going to try out the cheap gun, the expensive gun, and everything in between. It's going to be a good one. But thank you very much for watching. Please like, share, subscribe, all that good stuff they tell you at the end of videos, and check out some more of my other videos. Peace!